I'm Sister Diane Dalamoli, missionary of the Sacred Heart, and I came to Swaziland for the first time in 1998. Uh, at that time, I had another ministry I was doing, but by 2004, when I was free, I came full time uh, to Swaziland to work. And in that time of the AIDS crisis, the AIDS pandemic, when so many people were dying um, throughout the country, throughout the world, uh, but throughout this country, uh, I had the opportunity as a nurse to go out to the homesteads and really work with the people um, day in and day out over uh, many years. Uh, that this pandemic went on. And for me, uh, Swaziland was a, and has been, and continues to be, a transformative experience. I think that one of the things that stands out to me um, in the years that I've been here is the strength of the people who live with very few material resources, but they live with a certain joy and a certain trust uh, in God and in themselves that they will survive and move forward. And it is a big lesson. And the women of Swaziland I found to be uh, not only hard workers, but people who carry constant hope in their hearts for the future and for their children. And they know what it means to undergo hardship and to continue to move forward. Um, and to move forward often with great joy. Um, and in that sense, it has been um, a really wonderful, wonderful experience for me. Um, to come to bring the love of Jesus and to find that um, not only is the love of Jesus already here, but it is given back to me. Um, I have found uh, that it's a mutual enterprise to work in, in another country. It's a mutual enterprise of um, loving one another and doing the best uh, for one another and for the good of all the people. I'm forever grateful for my time uh, in Swaziland, which is now called Eswatini, uh, but I'm forever grateful for my time in Swaziland as a missionary sister um, because it taught me so much about myself, about other people, and about real concrete everyday love.